The Akron Zips hosted the Eastern Michigan Eagles on Saturday, February 1st. Akron entered the game sitting at 9-10 and, and hoped to capture their third MAC win. The Zips came out aggressive offensively as Shawnee Edmonds hit a three early in the game. Eastern Michigan's Corian Cardwell was a handful all day for Akron as she drives the lane here for the bucket. Haley Rynell's impressive alley-oop from Jordan Dawson put Akron up 22-21 at the end of the first quarter. The Eagles stayed vigilant though as this save from Dawson gets intercepted by Ariana Combs for the layup. Dawson bounced back though with a big three. She had an impressive day with 16 points. Look at this pass from Dawson to Lanasia Brewer as she fires it down the lane for the wide open layup. Combs' ability to weave through defenders made it difficult for the Zips as she got this one to fall at the end of the first half. The score at halftime would be Akron 42, Eastern Michigan 35. The second half was hard fought by both sides with increased defense and toughness shown by the players. This continued late into the fourth quarter. This game was getting close but Dawson continued her dominant performance with this tough basket. With 25 seconds left, the Eagles were down four and inbounded the ball to Juanita Augusto, who drove in for the layup. On the ensuing inbounds play, Eastern Michigan steals the ball and drains a three to go up by one with 15 seconds remaining. Akron inbounded it at their end of the floor and a missed layup by Dawson would be picked up by right now and put back in to take the lead once again. Eastern Michigan had a chance with .6 seconds left, but Augusto missed the game winner. But, as you can see, the referee called a foul in the act of shooting, giving Gusto two free throws. The pressure was on. The first, she missed. But she nailed the second to send this wild game into overtime. In OT, Akron was on fire as they got it to a lead and never looked back. This three by Alyssa Clay was the turning point in this game. Eastern Michigan tried to hang around with a three from Augusto, but this free throw by Shawnee Edmonds was the dagger. The final score was Akron 88, Eastern Michigan 81. Head coach Melissa Jackson had this to say after their first overtime win of the season. You know, I tried to stay just really calm, you know. Um, I got a really experienced group, um, even though it was our first overtime game. Just the look in these guys' eyes, you know, they, did, they wanted this so bad. And so um, I thought we were going to do what we did, and we came out and we executed, and we stayed in our zone, and we got rebounds, and uh, finished it off. I definitely knew that my team was going to come together, and uh, I, everyone, I knew that we were going to win in overtime. I knew that we were going to win by a lot in overtime. Like, I knew it wasn't even going to be close, because they get, we should have won that game like two, three times at the end of the game, and when we went into overtime, it was, I had no doubt in my team that it wasn't even going to be close by the end of the game. With ZTV Sports, I'm John Alfieri.